They need to come to some sort of agreement if they're going to have to get it done. And that means they've got to agree on fisheries and they've got to agree on the rules governing the UK continuing to have its privileged access to the single market, which, of course, is the jewel in the crown as far as the UK businesses are concerned. The trouble is the red lines are apart and there's no sign of either party moving on those red lines. Now, Michel Barnier, one concession he's made is that he was going to go home to Europe tonight. He's now going to stay in London for the weekend. Uh, they have have talked a bit about fisheries perhaps having some phased in changes but there's no real uh, difference uh, in uh, in their positions on that at this stage so that leaves us at a kind of a sticking point now it has to be concluded one way or the other really this weekend whether it's a no deal or an agreement because uh, the UK Parliament reconsiders the internal markets bill which some people have said uh, the, the couple of paragraphs in that are legally not workable uh, under international law there's a finance bill coming into the Commons on Tuesday, which may con uh, include wording on, on trade tariffs. And, of course, the European Commission has its last meeting of the year on Thursday. That is the last EU summit before the new year. So they have to look through any kind of deal by then, or they're just not there as an EU 27 to consider it at all. It would drift into 2021.